Jeremy Clarkson has opened up about his business woes, revealing his pub is routinely targeted by petty thieves who are allegedly pocketing glassware. The former Grand Tour favorite claimed 400 glasses were getting stolen from his newly opened establishment on the regular. This summer, hundreds of people flocked to the Cotswolds to become one of the first to taste the delights of 64-year-old Jeremy's new pub, The Farmer's Dog. Situated in Astall, near Burford in Oxfordshire, the establishment was formerly known as the dilapidated windmill by town locals, but is now earning its stripes for serving up British grub and traditional Sunday carveries. The pub is set in five acres of land and reportedly cost the father of three, less than one million pounds, to initially purchase. But since it opened on August 23, Jeremy's journey as a pub landlord has been anything but smooth. The presenter previously admitted he was possibly losing £10 for every customer who walked through the door, telling the Times, I asked a lie program to work out what the average price of lunch in a Cotswolds pub is and just charged that. It's possible that for every customer who comes through the door, he'd lose about £10. Now it appears things have gotten worse, with the BBC alumnus announcing people are actually stealing from the establishment. Jeremy used his weekly column in The Sun to touch upon how he has become a victim of theft, as well as other various food-related issues that have recently made headlines. He began by reminding readers how a group of faux French buyers swindled Neil's Yard Dairy out of 950 cheese wheels in October before discussing how shoppers are allegedly taking olive oil from supermarket shelves. The Clarkson's Farm star used the publication to discuss his thoughts on people, nicking poppy collection tins, as well as car doors, writing, and it's not going to stop because there is no chance they will be caught and even if, by some miracle they are, there will be no punishment. Jeremy then revealed how the farmer's dog is regularly ransacked by punters. Have a guess how many beer glasses are stolen from my pub every week? No. You're quite wrong. I'm afraid. It's 400. This means that on every day we are open we are losing 80, along with all the light bulbs from the lavatories and even the urinal traps. Jeremy's pub opened to the public on August 23rd and despite a myriad of rave reviews, has drawn criticism for its high menu prices, including a £19 bill for a plate of steak pie with mash and gravy and for pints of Hawkston beer and cider costing £6. The journalist has since defended his business pricing by explaining, Every single thing was grown by British farmers, even the black pepper and the sugar. Caleb Cooper, who works alongside Jeremy on Diddley Squat Farm, has also defended the pricing matrix, telling Metro, I don't think there's any difference in prices to any other pub. Clarkson's financial advisor Charlie Ireland has also claimed the prices are competitive for the Cotswolds area. He stated, We aimed for a bit cheaper than the local area because the pubs are sort of renowned for high prices. We've tried to make it affordable for people. Last month Jeremy revealed the farmer's dog was costing him, a fortune, to run, telling the mirror he had his doubts on whether he would, ever make, his, money back, after investing £1 million in refurbishing.